selfies. <laughs> <laughs> Let me take so, a selfie. Selfies and periscoping your self-eating pizza. Yes, that's what it is. Um, it's Lily. It's a, it's a new drone. Mm -hmm. And it's a little drone about pan size. And to activate it, you literally throw it in the air. And you've got a little tracking device that you hang on to. And you can either program it to go in front of you or alongside you, behind you, or go around you. So it'll follow you as you kind of do your actions. Uh, right now we're watching on the screen. Um, there's a, a guy I think he's snowboarding and uh, Lily is following him. Uh, it goes uh, full HD, 1080p. Um, it can only be airborne for about 20 minutes. And then when it lands back in your hand, it kind of lands very soft in your hand. Uh, it's waterproof. And um, I like this one where the guy just throws it off a bridge and it kind of swoops back up to take his video. And it's only, I think it's like $4.99 when it first comes out for the first month. And then it's going to go up to $8.99. Nah, see, I wanted it until you gave the, that's yeah, expensive. Yeah, but for what you're getting, that's not bad at all, yeah. actually. Yeah, the batteries aren't changeable. So you're, you know, you're stuck with the recharge mm -hmm. can in you, between. Can you manually control it or it's only, it only goes in follow mode? It only kind of goes in follow mode. You could change from the follow to beside you to lead mode to side mode. And then you could do like a loop mode, but it just kind of centering on this beacon. So, it's, okay. So it, it you, like, you're not controlling it. You're not doing anything. It just kind of goes out, does a pattern and comes back mm -hmm. like regardless. Mm -hmm. Wow. Of course. <laughs> See, that's really cool. Isn't it neat? It's in, It has a camera, and it obviously takes all your pictures. And that's there. your little beacon they're showing mm -hmm. there in the hand. Sound and uh, video. Wow. Hi, nice little family waving. Look at us. 12 megapixels. Oh, we're watching at home. How nice. Can, can it tell if it's in? Can it be used indoors? And how does it judge ceiling height? I don't, they don't show it. They don't show. <laughs> I think Grandma's taking it outside, thankfully. But uh, but but no, I, I definitely wouldn't recommend it. I wonder how. I wonder if it does have any kind of spatial kind of uh, look at that. But uh, that's that's still it's really cool. Uh, I mean, this is kind of this is what a lot of people want. This solves a lot of problems for people for all the X gamers, right? Mm -hmm. you, you got a GoPro here. You got a drone following you. Mm -hmm. uh, that's that's amazing. It's like playing Halo with that little robot following. That's you. I was thinking. Wasn't there wasn't there some kind of drone like that in one of the Call of Duty games? You kind of launch a drone and tag other players and yeah. What well, is the hunter killer drone? Which you just throw when I find somebody and goes and blows them up. But uh, I wonder if you you could probably modify this. But. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> we did not give you that idea. No, nope, 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 nope. But that that's really cool. That's uh that's something you could really use. Uh, I mean and, and you don't have to be a drone expert to do it because I mean that's one of the things uh you, you know we talked about before that idea of buying like the $50 drone so you can learn how to use it cuz you will crash the thing mm -hmm. before you get into something bigger or lose it in the river or something like that. You know, uh, I think about that every day when I try, when I take a train across the river it's like, you know, I'd love to have a drone and blast around in the city, but I don't want to crash it into a river. By accident you know <laughs> especially around here i'm looking at the faqs and one of the questions is can i use lily to spy on my neighbors <laughs> lily is always pointing at you and less than 100 feet from you pro tip best shots are, are at the uh, 10 to 30 foot range uh, also lily's motors make noise so other people will most likely notice <laughs> you are better off climbing a tree and using binoculars i like these guys there's some show there, there's some show i watched where they were getting buzzed by a drone and they were like shooting it out of the air um, just like in their backyard or something like that. But that was a fa modern family. Was it modern family? Yeah. I could see that. Yeah, I could see that. Uh, awesome. It's <laughs> I love these guys. Where can I not use Lily according to current FAA guidelines? Near airports, dot, dot, dot. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. I thought that's really enforceable, you know. You know, it always throws me because, I, I mean, for commercial use, drones are not, you're not able to use them yet. But I've been seeing, uh, you know, people, you know, finding on Twitter or LinkedIn stuff, like the people that specialize in shots with the drones. So are they just kind of hoping nobody notices or, you know, I'm not really an expert. We didn't get our friend from uh, from uh, Identified Technology mm -hmm. in here and, and, and clear that up a little bit because I'm sure he's a big expert on that by now since that's really his bo his business. So so I, I wanted to read. Oh, if you want to check it out, uh, lily.camera. Mm hmm. I like these, do these domains that are popping up lately. There was dot some camera. I've never, there's, there was another that. one that mm -hmm. was like dot document or something like that, that I got hit up on the other day. It, it, these domains have gone insane. Now, I knew they were selling a bunch, but now you're starting to see a lot of those kind of pop up. And you're, like, you're seeing that you, you, you see something like Lily dot camera and you're like, dot what, you know, what's the next mm -hmm. thing I'm waiting for a definitive dot 
three-letter thing, right? But uh, I, I, I don't know. 